but there's this desire for aggression that's in that, a real aggression, right? And it's not surprising to me, to me at all. It makes perfect sense. Um, but, what, but the basic plot is that the woman encounters this mysterious and aggressive male and tames him. That's the female hero myth, as far as I can tell. It's Beauty and the Beast. And so it's because, well, there's no fun in taming someone who's already tame. And what makes you think you really want someone who's tame anyways? There's no interest in that. Plus, when, when, when chaos manifests itself, what makes you think that someone tame is going to be good for anything? And it's a real question. And so that aggression is absolutely vital. It's absolutely necessary. But because it's inc incredibly dangerous, which of course it is, it has to be civilized. And so what happens is that the archetypal female in these pornographic romances seduces and tames the aggressive male. And that's her encounter with chaos. Now it's more, it's more comp of course females, they're more complicated and that's exactly how it is. And it's no wonder because their lives are more complicated. 